Hello guys and girls, Voices from the Dark here, welcome back to more Assassin's Creed 3, with Connor and me. So in the last episodes, we started the hunt for William Johnson, because he has plans to buy the land that our tribe is now positioned at, which is, you know, terrible news indeed. So we need to, we need to stop that, but in the comments lately, it seems like a lot of people want me to do more optional stuff. And also that is going to benefit me with uh, with the bonuses that can help me out in the main missions. And also some other miscellaneous advice. So we might actually go and do some miscellaneous objectives. I'm just kind of curious as to what right now. I know that we have some uh, taxation uh, or liberation. We can liberate, liberate Boston. I just can't remember or I can't see any markers that says anything with liberation. Ah. Okay, so that's now 90% liberated. And that's awesome. So if I run around some more, I might finish that up. I'm just trying to remove that stupid custom marker that I placed. And by the way, I have a new microphone. I'm still not sure if I like this one better than my old one, so I'm just kind of testing it for a few videos to see if I if I can get the uh if I can get the sense for it if I if I like it. And I don't know, it has much deeper sound, but it's not as clear as the other one, so... I'm kinda on defense on this one, but we'll have to see. Hey, merchant! Merchant! Talk to me! I need to trade. Let's see here. What can I sell? I don't think I have a lot. I just have um, some miscellaneous hunting items. I also... I didn't think that people would be, like, bothered to see optional stuff, see me hunting, but it seems like... <laughs> People do, and I will uh, take that into consideration, and we can do more more optional stuff. It really means a lot with your feedback. Right now I'm just buying everything. We don't even have a musket at the moment. Rope darts. Lethal. Oh, that's cool. We haven't really learned how to use it yet, so... I don't know if I want to buy one... I'll buy two, since I haven't really learned a lot about him yet. Poison darts. Uh, I don't really need it right now. More snares. Just buying some miscellaneous items. It's easy to get money in this. Trip mines? <laughs> Whoa, that is crazy. Alright, let's buy some bait. Alright. Because I think we're gonna go hunting later. See what we can get. Now, there used to be like. T oh god, my mother's calling me. Two seconds. Alright. We are back. But I remember like seeing the liberation icons all over the map. So now it's suddenly gone. Maybe I'm missing something here. Oh well, at least I am aware that I should be doing. Uh, that I should be doing them. Now, if I fast travel over here, there is like an assassination contract that I want to try out. That could always be fun, killing targets with a special condition. Boston Center Taxation. Meet with St Stefane. Yes. That would be nice, but where do I meet him? I can't really see any symbol on the map. Or is that like the... Okay. There's nothing that point towards... I'm just unsure. So let's see... Ooh! Doggy! I'm gonna climb you, doggy! That's how much I love you! Alright, the con... There we go. I wonder how we're gonna receive the contracts. I know that in the previous games it's been... Um, pigeons in cages. Alright. What do you want? Um, oh, okay. Was that all? Okay, did you put a target on my map? Oh, we totally don't need any dialogue or anything to help me explain. That would be silly. Now, where am I? Yes. Okay, he said thank you and... I don't know what else happened. Um, oh well. Perhaps some other time. Perhaps it wasn't meant to be. 
Peg leg trinkets. Ooh, what's that? What could that be? I'm just checking it out. Wait, peg leg. Isn't that... Wasn't that a uh, crazy dude uh, down by the... Down by the Aquila? Wasn't he saying anything about peg leg? <gasps> Perhaps there is something to the rumors. Arr. Or I don't know. But it's worth checking out. So we can see what's going on. Alright, let's see here. Peg leg trinket. What's this? Ah, okay. Don't really know what they do, but they seem to be a collectible. Anyways, I've really been advi- Ah, so... They okay, so I talked to that guy and now that thing appeared on my map. So let's go over there and check that now. It was kind of weird how it, it didn't like pop up a screen saying you should do this and this, but you know. <gasps> Kids! Run, Connor! Run! I've been told that if I do the homestead missions, I will get great bonuses. I think I'll get a lot of outfits and stuff, so that's always cool. So we'll definitely go out to the frontier again and have some fun there. Now let's see here, who am I to assassinate to- Oh, sorry, nope, not me, don't look at me. Don't trust anybody in this town. So, I guess these are rebels? Like, uh, Americans that are going to stand up against the British, I think so, at least. Since we've been kind of freeing the town. Oh. Okay then. Hey! What's up? Find a killer temp. Oh, so I talk to him, and then they kind of then I get like a set, a few set tasks, but I can't see them automatically on the. Oh, I I can actually. <laughs> okay then, that's fun. All right, wait. There's somebody all the way out there. Oh, buddy, I'm coming for you. I hope I don't have to swim. I hope it's just like at the end of. Uh, at the end of a... what's it called? What's it called? Like a wooden walkway on the... on the water. I also think somebody told me to stop by the general store. Because there are some new things I can buy. It was just a lot of comments, so I'm trying to remember... as many of them as I can. And I'm slowly approaching him now. Just have to swim across this goddamn ocean. But we'll be there and we'll kill him. Alright, so we took that guy out with our uh, tomahawk, so... Let's, uh, Hidden Blade would be nice, I think. Let's try to do an air assassination, that would be nice. Jump on him from above. Oh, he seemed to have disappeared off my map. I guess it's because he's like a moving target, so whenever he moves, my marker gets set off. Alright, so we got some more British here. So if I could do this without alerting the British... Die! That was me! Hwa! Okay. Next target on the map. Let's see, where are you? There's also a peg leg trinket over here and two assassination contracts there. Nice. You see, in the previous Assassin's Creed games, I've always been very much about doing everything I can on the map, doing every single um, optional objective. And so I thought people weren't really interested in seeing that, but I guess if I uh, kind of, you know, skip out or cut out a lot of the travels... Whoa, page! And Wolf also told me that there's it's not pigeons carrying the pages, they're just floating in the air, so, uh, well, derp. That was an error on my end. But if I just cut out, like, the traveling in and between, I could very possibly do most of the optional stuff if people are interested. So, what? And I... And keep running. Like nothing happens. Alright, now there should be a guy really, really close to here. There's also a peg leg trinket over there. I'm sorry, but if you give me a game with optional objectives and tell me you need to go around on this map, but you can choose whether you want to do this first or just go and do everything before you do that, I'm like, okay, I'm gonna do everything. Because I just really like the 100% um, the synchronization. Not that I think I will get it for this game. With all of the missions you have to replay and do it like just perfectly. Which can be kind of annoying, but I think we'll we'll do some optional objectives. And we'll steal from these people. 
Oh, this is the central district, right? So there are like different trinkets for different districts. All right, there's a guy over there. All right, let's take him out. <laughs> Never suspected a thing. All right, wait, did I kill him? There we go. Now I think I killed him. Yeah, he looks pretty dead. Where is the next target? I think this is the final target as well. Now, where can I go? Is there anywhere I can fast travel near this place? I can fast travel... I guess I could just run. There are just some... Um, view... No, guinea pig, shush with you! There are just some viewpoints that... No, shush, piggy! There are just some viewpoints that I haven't really... Unlocked yet. So we'll survive. Don't mind me, British people. I'm just Connor. Jumping on the streets. I'm just Connor. Smelling your bad feet. I mean, what? I'm just Connor. Running up the street. I'm just Connor. Killing your entire fleet. Because I'm a pirate. I am a pirate. Alright, so even though, like, the area is grayed out on the map, doesn't mean that we, we can't be there. It just means that, well, we're not far enough in the storyline to get any viewpoints there. South District. Under Templar control. Alright. I'm just kind of curious as to what I'm supposed to do with, the, like, the rest of the liberation in, in, the, uh, in the Central District. I think I just need to go and meet up with uh, Stefane somewhere. Okay, I placed a thingy right here. But is this where he is, or was it just to get down here? Alright. He's down there. Let's go get him. Alright, I just came to think... Oh, sorry. Wait. We do actually have a pistol. Alright. You also have that rope dart. <laughs> I don't know, I'm kind of curious to as how it how it works. Poison darts. Like, a lot of things they've, they've given us that I haven't... Ooh, we can even whistle for a horse? That's genius! And throw money to distract. I also have that pistol, which I guess is kind of cool. So now, that's my firing weapon. Which is nice, it's a lot faster than the bow, I think. But I think I'll just go bow for now. The rope dart. I don't really. I'm not really sure how it works, but I want to throw in, like, try and throw it into him and see what I can do. Connor style. Yeah. All right. Here we go. Let's climb up here to get a vantage point. Let's see now. No piggy, you need to shush, cause this is. Im I am very sorry about my guinea pig. Sometimes he, uh... Alright, hold Q and push... AVD to hang your target. Hmm, do I have to be up in a tree somewhere? Uh... I don't really get it. So I can't, like, throw this... Uh... <laughs> Get over here. <laughs> okay, so what's... <laughs> okay. That was a really, really nice one. Ah, oh, so I don't waste them if I just use it to kind of grab people and pull them towards me. Now, that works differently up in a tree, of course. But that was really cool, regardless. Alright, so we did the assassination missions. There are like a few other miscellaneous objectives, but for now... What do you say we go to the frontier and do some homestead missions? Maybe do some hunting. Can... Piggy! <laughs> I've also been told that if you do the... Uh, horses! If you do the... Oh, uh, now I lost my train of thoughts because of the horses. Great work, horses! What was I gonna say? Yes, if you do the... As, if you kill animals with a hidden blade, it still counts as a perfect kill for some reason. So... Yeah. That's why he was doing the hidden blade kill whenever I was not equipped with any weapon. 
I remember this rule. There was this was uh, this was where like the ghost of the carriage was. And God, I'm failing my English today. I'm failing my English so badly. Wait, this is a, a boring place in a. I thought I said go to the frontier. When I say the frontier, I expect you to go to the frontier. All right, uh, homestead. Can I teleport over here then? Sure can. All right. Ah, oh, he takes off his hood whenever he's around here. Oh, that's really, really cool. Okay, let me just check inside. What is that symbol that I see? Or is it outside? I never really walked around upstairs. It's a nice house. What's this? The Boston Massacre. Massacre on King Street. Whoa. There's no no. Yes, it's talking about the uh what happened down in the square. It's an historical event. We have no time for that. We need to go hunting, hunting. We need to hunt. Aw, all assassins are always so polite when they're indoors. No running, no jumping, no climbing. Okay. Let's do this. Now where's that symbol? It's right here. I'm suspicious. I can't really see anything, so I'm not really sure what that symbol's supposed to be. Oh well. I'm on top of the roof. Homestead mission. Yes. Ooh, there's actually plenty of uh, trinkets around and a peg leg mission. Interesting, interesting. Let's just go try out the whoa, homestead mission. And also keep our eyes open for animals. Because you never know. Wait. I heard somebody say arg. Must be a pirate nearby. <gasps> pirate. Oh. Can you help me? <gasps> I sure can. Hmm. That doesn't look good. Are you all right? What do you think? How did this happen? Poachers in the woods. I asked them to leave. This was their answer. Oh. Mom, we need to get that arm looked at. What if the men who did this? They can wait. Your wound cannot. I'll go kill them later, baby. But don't worry about it. You'll be able to make it to the house. Yes. I think the ball took only flesh. And what is your name? Miriam. Do you live nearby? I don't have a home per se. I took to the frontier when I was a young girl. I made my life out here ever since. Living where the land makes it easiest. Not a common choice for a woman of the colonies. No, it's it's not. But truth be told, it was this or the convent or the brothels. Ah, oh, sorry, I shouldn't have I wanted to listen to the conversation first. Alright. Come on. What are you doing? Those poachers need to be stopped. Saw the scabs from my hunting blind. Get to that and you shouldn't have any trouble finding them. Use the rope dart if you can. Get familiar with it. Yes. I would like some uh, some tutorial on that. That would be nice. Alright, let's go. Bam, bam. You don't mess with Connor. I wonder if I could kill that squirrel. I don't think I could. Killing squirrels up in the trees. Alright, we're getting closer. It's just so epically awesome running around in the trees here. Swish, swish, I am Tarzan. Jumping from rock to tree to squirrel. Alright, let's see here. It's time to test out the rope dart, I guess. Hold Q. Alright. Okay. Ah. 
I see. Okay, nice, nice. Oh, there's like an animal down there I would like to kill, but, you know. Right, now I want to try something else. What if I... Whoa! <gasps> okay! That's how I hang my targets from the trees. That's not bad. That's awesome. All right, and somebody told me that what it means when it says uh, Connor did not uh, Connor skinned and every animal. It's like the same as when you can't kill civilians with Ezio because he didn't do that. So if you don't skin the animals we kill, we'll, we will get desynchronized. Hey, dude. Check this out. Headshot. That was more like a body shot, but you know. Whoa. More is approaching. Get in the trees. Qua. Climb, climb, climb. This was like an awesome view though. If I press F, you kind of zoom up like this. Right, they're moving about there. Let's give them some rope dart fears. Why not? Boom. This would be very good for cinematic. Whoa. Dang it. Let's get out of here. Wah! It's time to die! Sla! Wah! Bang! Nice one. Alright, so what do you want to do? Oh! Okay, I should have seen that coming. <laughs> Get over here, dude. <laughs> oh, the rope dart's really nice, though. Kill the last poacher. Alright. Hey there. Whoa! That was nice, that was like a double gunner. I'll skin you. Skin. Nice. Alright. Hey! Where are you, fellas? Shooting <laughs> strangers in the forest, is that common hunting practice where you come from? No! I think bear me! Go! <laughs> Tell the friends you have left what happened here. There we go, that ought to show him. Nice one. Alright, good work, Connor. And I must say, the rope dart is really, really cool. I'll definitely be using that some more. Now, let's run back and see if we can find any animals on the way. Dun, dun, dun. We saved a fair lady. I'm back in town. men attack you it's no secret this land is full with game I spotted the trespassers en route to request permission to hunt here myself and suggested they do the same the bounty of the forest is not mine to give it is your right to hunt on this land but I would appreciate you trading your surplus with the others very well I accept okay so now she's gonna be hunting stuff for us stuff that we can sell to the stores I guess furs herbs and other hunting goods now available Nice! Silent Hunter. Alright, so... Is she inside? Where can I find her? I wanna see what she has for trade. Oh, there you are. I'm coming up. See anything? No, I don't actually. But I will take this shortcut. Alright. Any more missions around? Oops. Ah, uh, the hunting challenges. Right. I should probably do some of them as well. But they'll just come as we go. Now, there's this peg leg mission. And I'm just interested what that old crazy pirate dude is going on about. So, let's go and check it out. Let's take out any animals on the way there. Dun 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 dun. Oh lord, this is a, a beautiful game. I do enjoy it. Keep your eyes peeled. 
never know where the animals could be. Could be around any corner, anywhere, anytime. And it's our duty to hunt them. Because, well, we need to get money. And with money, we can buy stuff. Ah, looks like I'll be doing the classic jumping off the cliff again. Just because I'm too lazy to find a good way. Okay. Wait, predator moves. I can't see anybody to hang. Besides, I... <gasps> Die! Yeah. I don't know how many it works for. Yama. Yama. I think you can only do it on humans. It would be kind of weird if you could do it to, uh, two animals. Yauma. Stab. Nice. Now, Pegleg, tell me your story. Tell me about ancient pirate treasure. Arr. Alright, here we go. What do I owe this great honor, Captain? The letters you speak of, what are they? Oh, now you want to know. Captain Kidd's letters, boy. He hid a great treasure somewhere and sent letters to four of his crewmen along with a strange piece of leather. If you find the men, you'll find the scallywag. It's that easy, tis. May I see them? <laughs> you might be a captain, but you're not too bright, are you? I'll barter with them. You give me some trinkets I like, and I'll give you a letter. Building my own treasure cache, see? Trinkets? Like what? Where? Use your imagination, Captain. There's interest in swag all over the <laughs> Swag. Alright, first person's ever used swag. This is peg leg in the homestead about kids' treasure. Alright, I have already collected a few uh thingies. What you got for me? Ah, you brought me some good pieces. Last worth a letter to be sure. Here you go, Captain. I will be back for the rest. Alright. So I can uh new destination unlocked in the naval map. Yes, I know who Desmond Mile is, thank you very much. As always, if anybody wants to stop and read, you can do so. It's the father devoted the farm. South Dakota. It's just so it was just so random how the father came into the picture. Got some more? Let's have a look then. That won't do it, boy. Get some more and then we'll buy I wish they would tell you how, exactly how many you needed. Find six trinkets. All right. So right now we have two, but I know I saw something down here. This is great. We're on the trail of a great Ooh. Wolves. Get ready, boy. There we go. Whoa! Whoa! Stab! It's not over yet. Be on your guard. Whoa! Nice one, Connor. Now let's zoom into the tree. Yeah. Does he say that thing every time? Yauma. Yauma. Yeah. Okay. There's another trinket here, but only six trinkets, so that should be uh. Quite easy. One out of four trinkets in the homestead. That means the rest of the trinkets are right here. We might go and collect them in the next episode. But my name's Your Voice in the Dark. I hope you enjoyed seeing me do some more optional objectives, as that was kind of what the feedback was. People wanted to see more of that. So I guess I will be continuing with that in the next episode. And just, just do some more of this stuff, and then once I feel finished with that, continue the story. So, have a still good day, everybody. Take care and stay awesome. And try to stay warm in this cold, cold month. If you're up in the north, that is. Stay awesome, take care, and... <laughs> goodbye.